here is the React Casper client. I can design here like this. This should be uh, CCG F0 and this should be CCG F1. Now we can animate it from this timeline like this. But it has only four point animation. Start point, final point, final point two, and end point. So there is a new animation interface for this. To take this graphics to a new animation interface, we need to save this in local storage by clicking this save to local storage button. I am clicking it now. I will click web animator button. So this is the new animation interface. Now we can take the data from local storage by clicking here. Data from local storage. So here is the all the element which we designed in the previous interface. Now we can animate it here. We can select any element and we can click a sequence on the property panel. We can click here and it will be a keyframe here. Now we can move this cursor and move this element. So now this is animated. We can play by press button. So we can make an animation here. We can add element here also by clicking image like this. After making animation, we can play from here Casper control panel. Here is a Casper CG and we can click here play button and so this animation is playing here. Then there is a save panel here, so save panel button. This contains a list of all the previous saved graphics and when we click this list view, it is like this. We can save our newly made animation here by clicking save in new. Okay. So here is the, our new animation saved here. Let us click already made animation here. You can see here like this, this one, this one, this one and our save like this. This animation can be saved as a list and later we can import. So if we reset here, I can open the saved list. So here is the our last saved animation and it is already saved, it was already saved animation. The current animation can be exported as an HTML file for later use. From here export HTML. I am saving this in template directory as test 100 html. Now we can put our data with Casper CG client. I have added this template in the Casper CG client here and here is a Casper CG. I can press F2 and this comes. Here I have put data as CCG F2 as Australia PNG and CCG F1 as RCC animation and CCG F1 as new animation interface has been made and the text here is by default string to fit because when I put more text here it adjusts the text by shrinking. Later we can import the same template and modify it and we can press the override button to override it. It is like FT generator in Casper C. We can send this in animation to OBS or Vmix directly by putting the HTML client address as address for browser or web source. I am copying this address and putting a browser 
in OBS and putting this address. I can send this animation to OBS directly. We can record this animation by clicking record button. It will give you a video with green background to use in Adobe CC for editing purpose. This is the animation with green background which we can take in Adobe CC for editing.